PennDOT announced a major project coming up next summer that will shut down the Parkway East for a month. Yeah, KDK's Josh Taylor explains what this is and why it's not too early to start thinking about how you're going to handle it. We are here beneath the Commercial Street Bridge on the eastern side of the Squirrel Hill Tunnel, and PennDOT officials say this bridge replacement project is the first of its kind in this area. It's a stunning uh, uh, engineering feat. It's a stunning construction feat, uh, and I am eager to see that all transpire next year. That feat will happen next July when crews will build a new bridge parallel to the existing roadway on I-376, then take the existing bridge down. After that, they'll slide the new one into place. It's incredibly innovative. Uh, and, and what we're going to do here and slide this new bridge into place in a, in a one month period is, is really something to be proud of and something incredible. To my knowledge, this is one of the highest structures that have ever been slid into place and certainly maybe one of the longest at 960 feet in length. This project behind me is a prime example of an investment that we're making on a bridge that is in a main artery to the beautiful city of Pittsburgh and is traveled by more than 100,000 vehicles per day. The original bridge was finished in 1951 and it's gone through three rehabilitations and state officials say they must replace it. It can no longer carry permit loads, okay? Some permit loads are not something we think about every day, but these are, are extremely large loads, heavy loads, heavier than legal. Now there will be two closures as part of this project. The first will be here along Commercial Street for three months starting at the end of this month. The second will be along I-376. That's next July. And the question on everybody's minds is why? The trade-off uh, is significant because the, tr the neighborhoods on both sides would be affected for a period measured in years instead of just the one month. PennDOT says they chose July for the shutdown because that's when there's the least traffic volume on the parkway. But they're warning everyone ahead of time. If you can work from a remote location, please do. The more traffic we can get off of the local roads, the better. We expect it to be congested. We expect it to be very challenging for everybody. Reporting along the Parkway East, Josh Taylor, KDKA-TV News.